Hey ladies and gentlemen, and thank you for joining me back here at Survival Preparedness for Beginners. And today I have a treat for you. I'm doing a review on a battery bank. Now, before you click away because it's on a battery bank and everything else, hear me out because this one is different than the rest. All right, we're talking about the Ampace 600 watt battery bank, 17.6 pounds packed full of a punch. I'm telling you folks, this thing here is incredible. It'll run a lot of different things as you're gonna see here in a few minutes. And this thing actually does something that very few other battery banks do. So you're gonna to wanna to stick around and see what that is. This thing here is just a quite a piece of equipment to have in your backup for you and your family. If you're gonna go on trips, if you're gonna go camping, if you're going anywhere, if, even if you're in your own home and you lose power, this is the battery bank that you would wanna have with you at all times, wherever you're at and wherever you're going. So let's get going on this video so you all can see what this bad boy can really, really do. Okay, so most of you probably really want to know what is so special about this. All right, right up here, you have your LED screen. Shows you what you got. When you turn things on, this is for all your USB ports and all that. This is for your DC, and that's for your two 110 volt. As you can hear, the fan kicks on. As soon as you turn it on, it goes back up. All right, has incredible features. All right, the first feature you wanna talk about, right here, the very top, this is your input. This is where you charge your battery bank. You can charge this with a solar panel. You can charge this with a wall charger or a car charger. Basically the standard things that come in a box with any battery bank, this is what this thing will charge with, okay? Now you come down here, you have your cigarette lighter. You have your two DC output right here. You have a USB-C on the very top, 60 watt, a USB-1 output, that's a fast charging output, so that's what you really wanna pay attention to right there if you need to charge your cell phone real quick, and two regular USB ports right here. Two 110 plugins right here that you can plug anything in. Max wattage is uh, 600 watts on these bad boys. All right, this is where this machine really kicks butt. Two things. Right here, in here, if you buy the adapter that goes into here, this will jump start your car. It's a 12 volt jump starter. You can always just plug that right in there. You get the um, clamps, you clamp it onto your battery the proper way, and it will jump start your car. Another great feature that this has that a lot of battery banks don't in this price range. Okay, extended battery on this side. As you can see, you can put another battery bank and extend the, into this battery bank here, generate more power and everything else to meet your basic needs. All right, I did say in the very beginning, this unit does weigh 17.6 pounds. It's a 600 watt battery bank with 584 watt hours. The extended battery, it does support that. So it's a great feature to have. It is certified. It has the pure shine uh, wave towing 600 watts. It's got a surge of up to 1200. Now, some of the great features with this battery that I want to tell you about are it's a lithium ion. It's got 1000 cycles. Some of the protections that this whole unit here has, which is just incredible, folks. It has over voltage protection. It also has the overload protection. So if you're trying to do too much on it or whatever else, it's gonna shut it down so it doesn't damage the machine. It has a over temperature protection. If you've been running it too long or gets too hot, it's gonna shut off. It also has a short circuit protection built into this machine. Very, very popular. It has a low temperature and a high temperature protection. So if you're trying to use this in too cold of weather or too hot of weather, it will turn off the machine before it damages the machine, which is a very good thing 
for anybody that lives in the south where it's really hot or in the north where it gets really cold and it has an overcurrent protection so basically if you're trying to either charge it with too much if you're trying to uh too much current goes into this machine like if there was a power surge or something like that it's going to protect this battery bank right here now it does has your your led lights up here you get two brightness three actually then it goes into your strobe your sos and that is it all right let's see what this thing can do all right so this ampe 600 watt battery bank we all know it's going to power all the basic stuff i mean i'm not going to sit here and go through everything it's going to power any laptop you got any cell phone any type of device that you have a drone uh, cameras, uh, lights, flashlights, it's going to go through all that kind of stuff. I'm not going to show that charging on here. I mean, this thing is a 600 watt machine. It's going to charge all that stuff with just fine. What I want to know is, will it run my refrigerator? Everybody's been asking about battery banks that run refrigerators and stuff. So let's see if this 600 watt battery bank has got what it takes to run your refrigerator. So here we go. So first thing we want to know is refrigerator is off. All right, we're going to leave that door open so everybody can see. Now, let me get my camera right there. Now, here's our battery bank. Here's our cord for the refrigerator. Let's plug her in. Let's see what happens. There you go, folks. She's running the refrigerator. Now, here's the problem. It's only a 600 watt machine. So what you have to really pay attention to is what I'm gonna show you that it's pulling five watts, which doesn't make sense. Your refrigerator, when I open the refrigerator door, you see how that drops? See, the door's open and it dropped. Now I close the refrigerator and it's telling me it's running my refrigerator and it's only pulling five watts. It's saying it's, it has 56, 57 hours. That's just amazing, folks. Let's see here. Open the refrigerator door. 42 watts with the light. That's the only thing that's coming on. Close the refrigerator door. It drops back down to 5 watts. Amazing. So the great thing about this battery bank is if you're going to be out in the woods if you have a grid down location maybe you have a cabin in the woods or something that you just get away to you may want to have this even around your own home or in your car if you are traveling because with all the attachments and stuff that you can get you can jump start your car and everything else so you want to make sure that you are picking up one of these bad boys right here so far this is the best battery bank that i've run across this thing is just amazing folks it's a 600 watt pack full of all kinds of power it's going to get you through just about any type of season you can have it on those nice camp outs when the foliage is falling and it's really nice outside and everybody just loves to be around the fire you can always have one of these as a battery backup and then also for everybody's favorite time of year winter you know i mean this machine will get you through all four seasons and it'll also make sure that you are protected in case anything ever did happen and you needed quick power particular battery bank this ampace this thing is just awesome folks it's very well built it's very very well put together i mean this thing is like a a tank inside of a box here you know and as you saw in the video this is just an incredible piece of equipment that you need to have in your arsenal for those type of days whether it be spring, summer, fall, or winter, 
So this way here, you're protected throughout all the seasons and that you can always be ready for the unknown. I'm telling you, this thing is just incredible. It is a uh, great piece of machinery. I am glad that I was able to do a review on this. I think this is probably one of the best battery banks that I've done a review on. And I really do believe that this thing here is worth the money and that it is something that you want to make sure that you have in your arsenal because what it can do is just amazing and the features that it has in a small compact unit like this a 600 watt unit and what it does what it offers you can't beat it a lot of these different additions that this machine has you have to spend thousands of dollars in order to get these type of additions, the extended battery, the jump start, and all this kind of stuff, and you're getting it out of a 600 watt battery bank. So I'm Survival Preparedness Beginners. Thank you for joining me on this review today. I really hope everybody really checks into this, at least take a look at it and see what you all think, because I think you'll be very pleased if you do. Till next time, I'll catch everyone on the flip side.